I'm, you know, here for my grandma, my sister, my husband, my child, and for all the other people who are experiencing, you know, entry into this club that <laughs> probably we'd all prefer not to be a part of. It was a total shock for me. Um, my family had had no experience with diabetes at all. And you get through that shock and then you get to a point where you sort of are able to manage things. My sister was diagnosed at age three, but and it, we live with it in our family, but I was never responsible for her care. So I didn't see the signs. It was a pretty jarring moment later when we realized that basically if I had waited another 12 hours, I would have been in a coma. You know, we were older and we were professionals, and I think we just both rolled up our sleeves and said, let's have a plan of attack. And I just attacked it as hard as we could. One of the things you hear is that there might be limits on what you can do. And if I've picked up on one thing from people with JDRF, if you want to get them to do something, tell them they can't. To hear people say, oh, you got an insulin pump, so you don't have to worry about this anymore. You just want to scream, because I've got a six-year-old son, and he has a chronic medical condition, which can be deadly. And, and it's not theoretically deadly. It actually happens, and it's heartbreaking. But it's also heartbreaking just for him to manage the day-to-day -day existence of it. I'm hungry. You're hungry? Let's do a test. Come on with me. See what you're at, okay? Okay, 58, that's kind of low. Do you want to go get some granola bites? Yeah. There you go, buddy. When you are talking with friends whose children aren't, don't have diabetes, they just can't fully understand. It would be nice to never have to get low. And understand what's involved, and sometimes it's just nice to be talking to people who do. And then, William, I do want you to be able to run that pattern we talked about. We've realized is this is something that affects you every single day and no individual thing is impossible But in the aggregate it takes a toll Every day Have to deal with the fact that they have a sick kid and it doesn't seem like it, but that's the way every day is Hello. Joseph has been far more supportive than I would have ever thought an eight-year-old could be Will they piss a pop out at him all the time? And he doesn't like it. One of the things that I worry about um, are long-term effects. My grandmother lost her sight as a result of type 1 diabetes. And you, I worry about long-term, um, the longer he has it, without finding a cure. A cure is out there. I mean, better management is out there, and that's great, and we should push for that. But I think everyone at this gala would rather be at some other gala. And I just feel like we owe it to him. We owe it to him to find a cure. And JDRF, to me, is the path to that cure. I like to find a cure for diabetes. So then I don't have diabetes. <laughs>